Hey everyone, my name is Conchetta, and I'm the museum manager and curator at the museums at Lyle Station Park. You are listening to a tour tidbit, a podcast minisode giving you a few basics about one of the museum's typical tour stops. So pull up a chair and some pictures of this minisode's focus, the Bobian Tavern. A good place to find us is on our Clio walking tour by going to www.theclio.com, T-H-E-C-L-I-O, and typing Lyle, Illinois in the top search bar. That's L-I-S-L-E. You'll see all of our Clio walking tour entries pop up when you scroll down, so make sure you pick the Bobian Tavern. If you're already on a virtual field trip with us, you're a step ahead and already have the link. Hit the pause button and pull it up. I'll wait. Okay, we are inside one of the oldest buildings still standing in DuPage County, the county we're in. It was built in the early 1830s and is a great example of what businesses were like when the first European immigrants settled in this part of America in the 19th century. That's another way of saying the 1800s. Museum staff and volunteers set up this building to show what it looked like when it was being used as a 19th century tavern, which is like a hotel and a restaurant all in one. Mark Bobian, who you can see in some of our pictures, is a pretty famous business owner in Chicago and in Lyle. He moved here with his family to buy the building and the land around it to run his tavern business while they lived in a home next to it. Some of his family members were even buried in the family cemetery right next to the tavern. You can still visit that place. It's called the Bobian Cemetery. You can find information about it and Lyle's other historic cemetery across the street from the museum by visiting our website and looking at the Historic Cemetery online walking tour. The building was used for other things throughout its history, too. Some people used it as a home, and a local company even used it for storing their important papers. It wasn't always here at the museum, though. We picked up the whole building and moved it down Ogden Avenue on a truck to the museum in 1989. Lyle Heritage Society volunteers and Park District staff restored it back to what we think it looked like when it was used as a tavern. Take a look at our online resources for pictures and more. And field trippers, don't forget to check your instructions page to see everything we gave you. You can find us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter at Lyle Museum, or by our website by going to www.lyleparkdistrict.org and clicking on facilities at the top. Or you can Google us, that usually works too. Thanks for listening from Lyle, Illinois and everywhere else where history is being made every minute. Our theme song was created by Big Cats. 